and clean? My bed clean. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know I was here. Okay. Your room is pretty good, Chels. Put away those clothes. Chelsea. <laughs> <laughs> Put your underwear away, Ash. Yeah. Okay, I like your room. I like the giggles. I'm gonna go shower, okay? okay. Shall I'll be there. <laughs> She's so creepy when you're doing uh, that. Playroom. Can we? That's Ashley. Chelsea, you know, whatever okay. you do, really chubby baby. She's getting that creepy. Oh, God, okay, I need you to clean up the playroom. Ashley, Ashley, go clean up the playroom, okay? Ashley, see if you can clean up the playroom before I get out of the shower. Ashley, Ashley, you'll get a chocolate cookie if you clean this up before I get out of the shower. Yeah, what? I said Ashley. One Sorry. <laughs> All right, Ashley's taking the last of my dirty laundry down, and we'll see here. Okay, so you're still playing with Hatchimals, you said. Yeah. Right there. Yeah, can you take yeah. Abby her math book, yeah. and then can we put this junk right here away? Is that a deal? Yeah. And then you can have a cookie. Um, I think we could use a little bit of help over here by the doll section. Chelsea. Yep, I'm gonna have Chelsea come work on this. Okay, throw that stuff away and then I think you're done. Maybe get dressed? You think? No? No. You don't wanna get dressed? No. Turn off the light? Shut the door? Shut the door? Thank you. Okay, Ashley, what are you doing? Wrapping Abby's present. Ooh, our secret. It's not from ColourPop, is it? This is just a box I had in the garage. Yes, sir. Right? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so you're going to wrap your present, right? Yes, sir. Abby can help you now because we've hidden what it is. Yeah, but she can't look in. She can't look inside the box. Okay, Abby? Abby! I can't see it. Don't sneak a peek. It won't close, though. Uh, just get some tape. All right, you guys. Oh, I think I cut myself shaving. I know I cut myself right here. I didn't go downstairs and get coconut oil. Do you have the tape? I didn't go downstairs and get the coconut oil, so I just was kind of trying to shave off some of the dry patches on my face. I haven't really picked up the camera except for showing you all the different things that we've been cleaning. We've just had a quiet afternoon. It's very nice. I'm whispering now because Chelsea's asleep up in her room. And let me show you the status of my laundry. <laughs> I've been taking you along so far. All right, so that load just barely finished. I just took that load out and put it up here. This is Chelsea and Ashley's laundry. So there's Chelsea's dress for church. I still have towels and heavier stuff from everyone's, like jeans from Abby and Kaylee. So that's a heavy load. And then we have the lighter load of Kaylee and Abby's stuff. And I folded whites and another load of ours so far. And this is all that we've hung up so far. This load in here, <laughs> literally all of Kaylee's sweatshirts. I have to do like one heavy load with all of her heavy sweatshirts because she's addicted to big sweatshirts. It's kind of ridiculous. All right, second to last load washing, third to last load drying. I'll come in here in a minute and watch the finale of greatest baking show and hang all that stuff and then we just have that load left so we've made progress in the laundry room and current situation in the kitchen is it's clean but now these dishes I can't get this to start watch I hit start and I it won't do anything I hit all these buttons normal load Tough scrub plus, heated dry, hit start, shut it, and it stops blinking and won't turn on. I don't know what it is. At first I thought it was because I needed to drain it, but it's not working. So Jason told me to not stress about it, that if I had time, I could look up on the Maytag website or YouTube videos to see if I can find like a how to fix it type of tutorial or something or other. I'm not gonna deal with it because if I figure out that it's actually broken, then I'll have to wash all those dishes by hand. You guys, the laundry is like never ending. This is the kids' clothes and it's not even done yet. I still have two very, very full loads left in here. But look, nothing left on the floor. I'm so happy. I just need these last two left done. 
and a sign that I'm done with laundry for the most part is hangers. So clearly I have a lot of Abby's in the washer or dryer and a lot of mine and Jason. We have extras, but I'm, I'm getting there. So I'm going to... Uh... Jason's here. We were thinking that, that the plug for the dishwasher was going to be under here to reset it. Will you put these trash bags Ugh. underneath, please? Yep. Thank you. So he's just as tired as I am, so I was going to make cheese sandwiches and I don't have any cheese except for string cheese, which doesn't really work well. I have turkey and potatoes and gravy and I could make a vegetable, but then I won't have dinner for tomorrow and it's Sunday, which is trickier to find a meal. So. I don't know what we're gonna do. All right, I offered to pay these guys two dollars a piece. You should do three. <laughs> I might. If you guys do a really good job, I might pay you three dollars a piece. Um, excuse me. Okay. <laughs> so enough. we had to unload the dishwasher. This is and all that they. That you got to clean all of this. They've already got a full sink so far. And I'm going to go out with my friend really this is quick. what it looks like when we put Ashley in here to yeah. clean her when she was so small. I know. She yeah. was like a tiny little baby. Yeah, because Daddy right now is watching how to fix our dishwasher mm. on YouTube. All right, so I just got home from hanging out with my friend. And look at all the dishes the girls did. <laughs> so glad we have a dishwasher. I don't want to... Oh, we've already put them away? So I just went to Target with my friend. We were, her cousin's moving here from Texas. So we were trying to get into their new house and the codes weren't working. And anyway, then her son got sick in the car and it just took forever. So it's like 10 o'clock at night. I just got home and I'm gonna call it a night. I don't know, weird Saturday. I guess it was just all cleaning and laundry. And I think I have all my laundry done. Let's go check. I think that was the only thing I had sour cream. Oh, yeah, I think that's it. I think so. It was not a glamorous day at all. <gasps> Jason hung the laundry, you guys. Oh, he hung all the rest of that laundry, folded all these socks. That was what dinner was tonight because we got kind of desperate with stuff. But that's awesome that he finished all that laundry. I'll have Abby come and get this laundry here take it up um that's, he's a good man and he's gonna sew the couch cushion we still haven't fixed the washing machine maybe he's found a or the dishwasher I mean maybe he's found a solution I haven't had a chance to talk to him yet so I'm just gonna sort socks and then I'm gonna go to bed I'm gonna go and lay in bed and probably watch YouTube <laughs> but sorry this wasn't more of a glamorous day but Sometimes you just need to have a day of catching up on chores and laundry. You know, keeping it real. Someone commented, I forget your name and I feel so bad now. Oh, I can't remember. It starts with an M. You're new to my channel. And they commented that they appreciated that I keep things real. Keep it very real around here, folks. <laughs> Dirty laundry and all. I think we did eight loads of laundry today. So we're about as real as they get. If you like keeping it real, stick around. I'm not coming in the laundry room for a couple days. That should suffice for a while. So take care you guys. Have a good night. So Jason left me a kind little note. <laughs> I just went out to the garage to get myself a cold beverage. This one dropped on the floor by the way. He didn't see that. But I thought that all of my huge case that I just got was gone. But apparently he's hidden them and would like to have his own supply back. So it looks like I'm gonna have to go and give him. No, I don't want him now. I'm going to bed. You're going to bed? I'm going to bed. So tomorrow when I give you some s'mores, I'm all hot and flushed because I've been doing something. Can't talk about it right now, but so tomorrow when I give you his s'mores back, you'll give me my Coke. Yes? I don't know, you look like you're really wanting it. <laughs> he really wanted s'mores before I went out tonight and I forgot. I forgot to get it for you. Oh. Okay, now I'm officially going to bed. I can't even have this. It's too late now. <sighs> Good night, guys.